Now the Raptors with it. Go for the Raptors right now. And an Obi the three with Siakam at the four. Then there's Mitchell Robinson. Then it's Fred Van Vliet. And it's Money in at the point guard position. And Grant, as you watch the league since you retired, what do you think is the biggest change? Well, you started to see the three-point boom change towards the end of my career. And of course, also, how centers are used is probably the biggest change of them all. It's good. Elevating his playmaking over time, Siakam recognizes when his teammates have clean looks. Here's Russell. It doesn't go for him. See Ockham with the defensive effort. Pass to Ananobi. From downtown, gets the three ball to go. This is what you already like about OG Ananobi's game. Has a good feel for where to get his shots along the perimeter. Russell from outside. Fires in the triple. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Money misses. For Minnesota, they've gone two of six from the floor. Here's Miller. And an OB covering. Pass to Edwards. And another three for Minnesota. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. And lead outside. Here's Money. Off target with the three. And all quarter long, it's been the same story. Inconsistent with this offense. Reed passes to Edwards. He shoots again. Oh, and he got fouled on his way. Fred Van Vliet. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. And give him the lead. And the free throw is good. Now leading by one. And Anthony Edwards. He had his ups and downs as a rookie. The talent is abundant, though. Yeah, I mean, he just needs to learn his spots on the floor. Find where he's most effective attacking. And once he gets all that sorted, he'll be a more consistent player. Well, if you let him shoot freely, you're going to give up a lot of trades. And Minnesota calls time. All right, look who's coming on the court. Come on and get live for your Minnesota Timberwolves dancers. Let's get the hand, fans. Your Timberwolves dancers. Minnesota with the ball. Trailing by two. Russell, that's good. Coach is loving the ball movement. Here's money. That three's off the mark. Minnesota has gone three of three from outside and looking sharp here in the first. On the take, as to Prince. Now here's Russell, tightly guarded. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Russell's got seven points. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Money with the bucket. Want to score in the NBA? Picks can really force the D to make tough choices. The Timberwolves have gotten 50% of their shots to fall so far. They're 5 of 10. Russell from outside. It's hauled in by the Raptors. They're fresh off a win against the Pelicans. Yeah, they connected from outside all game. And the defense had absolutely no answer for it. They embraced the challenge as well. They hit big shot after big shot to keep the other team at bay. So it's Minnesota now after the basket by Toronto. Outside Russell with the drive to the left side wing. Fires the three. Knocks down the triple. He's got 10. His shooting has been fantastic, and this team has leaned on him. Pass to Siakam. Here's Van Vliet. To the wing on the left. Let's go with a three. Miller pulls it in. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. The Timberwolves hit again from deep. The defense is nowhere to be found guarding the three-point shot. It's Edwards on the wing. Back to Russell. Fires high post. And Ananobi pulls it down. Won't see him miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might 
want to go back to again. Outside Edwards. Pass to Russell. And it's stolen by Van Vliet. And now the Raptors on the break. Let's it go from deep. Shot no good. What I like, he hasn't stopped competing despite the off night. Russell with the ball. And it's Ananobi picking him up. Reed to screen on Ananobi. Russell to pass to Reed. Right side Edwards. Shot clock at five. Here's Miller. Poke loose. Oh, stolen by Ananobi. Inside. Money with the bucket. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly. Toronto trailing. So for Toronto right now, Van Vliet teams with Ananobi on the perimeter. Mitchell Robinson is out there with Pascal Siakam, and it's Money in at the one spot. Well, guys, Money in the last outing against the Pelicans got the job done. He had 65 points and was on point from deep. Monster production. He was focused. He was relentless. Everyone is still buzzing about it, guys. Great report there, Allie. It was obvious he could do anything he wanted. A fantastic win. Well, I'll tell you, he was enjoying himself out there, kind of like us here in the broadcast booth. And whoever was matched up against him wasn't enjoying themselves. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. Driving in. And it's Toronto with a rebound. There is the value of great rim protection without fouling, forcing the miss. Siakam outside, down low. Doubled by Beasley. Here's Ananobi. And he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. Seven foot two wingspan, OG Ananobi throwing it down. Pass to Reed. Now here's Edwards. He's guarded closely. Excellent D there from Siakam. And he's going for the lob. And a big finish by Robinson. They keep capturing the lead, then giving it back. We'll see if they can hold on to it this time. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Edwards can't hit. The Raptors with a lead. Here's Van Vliet. The rebound by Beasley. Bad offense against bad defense. The play looked as ugly as you'd imagine. Again, the miss by Edwards. Started out strong for three-point land. Hit two in the first quarter, but he's gone dry since. And staying with it. He drained two triples in the first quarter. Now gets this one. Pass to Reed. Here's Prince. He's covered by Siakam. Here's Miller. And here's Reed. Five on the clock. They need this. That one's wide left. For Toronto, they've got three of six shots to go here in the second quarter. Ananobi on the wing. Pass to Money. Now here's Siakam. Takes a three. Oh, again, Toronto with a triple. Becoming more consistent with this shot. Siakam forcing the defense to come out and guard him. Minnesota has possession. Seven-point differential. And Edwards with the basket on the assist by Reed. 
Edwards has got 12 points. He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. Drains the triple. Three. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Beasley against Van Vliet. Beasley outside. Reed to screen on Van Vliet. And it's Beasley penetrating. It goes. He's made three shots in six attempts. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. The three is up. Money misses. It's amazing. All night, he's been out of sync on the offensive end. Yet, they continue to lead. And here's Edwards outside. And he scores it. Now five of nine from the field. Woo! He got a clean look, and he makes the defense pay for disrespecting him. Outside, Ananobi. Pass to Siakam. Money. Last game, an incredible scoring display for him. To counter the size deficiency, Van Vliet has developed an insane number of moves inside. And he's coming off a breakout season. Oh, wow! Oh, crazy good! VA, I'm not sure he should be flaunting around the rim like that with this game so close. Oh, it's risky, but it sure did look good. Got a piece of it. Edwards against Van Vliet. Here's Money. And a great assist by Van Vliet as that one goes. Van Vliet's got three assists tonight. <laughs> They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four last five buckets have been threes. Reed to screen on Van Vliet. Pass to Prince. Here's the three. Rebound by the Raptors. This game against Minnesota is the first time they've met this year. Not exactly the biggest game on the season schedule, but both teams are capable of flashing serious potential. You know what? Every win counts in this league, and both of these teams want every victory they can get. Woo! He's been red hot from three-point range. How long will he keep it up? That's going to be over and back. I'm watching the line on that one. Today with social media than ever before, you think it helps squash problems or does it foster rivalries? Well, I mean, you, we've seen it on both sides. Some of these guys, obviously rivalries and a lot of chatters talk between social media and a lot of these guys are friends. It's just the way you use it. I think it can be an advantage or a disadvantage at times. Pass to money. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. He's got 24. He drops yet another dive, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. And here's Russell. He's got 10. Achua with a steal. And here comes the break. Here's Money. And hits a three from the wing. And the Raptors lead by 14. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for the Raptors. Their aggressiveness on D has been the most glaring aspect of this game so far. They have the heat turned all the way up in this first half. You know what else, guys? Defensively, they've been able to cause some turnovers tonight and turn them into points. To the middle. Here's Trent, bearing his second of three attempts. They just look so overwhelmed inside. That's why they continue to get attacked. Pass to Reed. Edwards with it. He takes it in. So it'll be two free throws. Precious Achua. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. Vanderbilt's checked in for Reed. The Raptors also with a sub. Gibson's checked in for Siakam. Well, the Raptors shooting a fantastic 57%. It's Dragic with a drive. Great crossover to get free. Two <laughs> there just. Slow down, Brad. That's his first Let them play. Interior. You know what? We look back at Goran Dragic's career. He's always produced BA. Good efficiency from earlier in his career. 
And with Dragic, you forget how long he's been in the league. You're so right. Didn't become a starter until his fourth year in the NBA. But he quickly showed his value in the starting lineup and has never had a problem finding steady minutes since then. McDaniels inside. Achua defending. McDaniels can't hit. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession, except for the result. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Thanks, B.A. The Minnesota Timberwolves and their sister franchise, the Lynx, under new management, or at least that's the plan starting in 2023. A key part of the sales agreement was stipulation that the teams remain in Minnesota, something that's got to make the fans in the Twin Cities very happy. Oh, that's great news, Allie. Thanks for that. McDaniels can't hit. Here's Toronto now. They're on a 20-6 run. And out of bounds, Minnesota will have it. Minnesota with the ball. Here's Russell. It's deflected. Nice defense from Todd. One of the best rim protectors in this league. This is bad. Like, really bad. One thirty-three left to play in the first half. Here's Money. And again, Toronto no good. Yeah, I know. He usually makes you pay from that range. Trent with a double. Pass to McDaniels. Three-pointer. Good. Third basket in six attempts. That's why you have to think twice before sending a double team at someone. Out left to the wing. Back to Dragic. Up and over Russell. Dragic misses. Minnesota's gone 2 of 4 from beyond the arc in the second quarter. Here's Okogi. And the three off target. The Raptors shooting it well, around 55% for the game. Edwards comes with a double team. It's stolen. Pass to Okogi. Here's McDaniels. And it's rejected. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. The three is up. Hits the trifecta. 30 points in the game. Riding the hot hand, and why not? If something's working, keep going to it. Russell against Dragic. Step back and fire. And so he draws the foul. Goran Dragic. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. The Raptors making a switch here. And both free throws good for Russell. To the right side. Here's Money. Ooh, he released it in time, but it's off the mark. The Raptors, 67. And for the Timberwolves, they're shooting the ball at around 42% for the game. The backcourt is Russell and Edwards. Torian Prince is out there with Nas Reed. And it's Miller in at the three spot. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. To the inside. Outside Edwards. Over to the left wing. Russell from outside. That shot off the mark. And you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight. Money. It's good. And give the assist to Siakam. Siakam's got three assists in the game. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Back to Russell. Reed to screen on Siakam. Puts it up from 12. Second shot opportunity. Robinson with the block. To the left wing. Here's Money. Pure from three-point range. For three. These are big buckets. He's been instrumental in helping them try to close out this game. 
Russell against Robinson. To the wing, right side. Here's Prince. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Prince has got six points. Prince has got better at creating his own shot, but the catch-and-shoot game is still his specialty. Left side, Ananobi. Right wing. Here's Money. And the Raptors getting another bucket right there. You really have to question the defensive effort on that possession. They are getting bare tonight with plays like that one, allowing too much space for a good shooter. Picked by Prince. High arcing shot. The shot by Russell, no good. The Raptors have gone three of three in the second half. To the paint. Stripped it away. Here's Miller, and an OB covering. Miller can't get it to go. He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. Minnesota's going one for two from outside the arc in this third quarter. Oh, that bucket gives him his seventh field goal in 12 tries. He is torching a defense that simply has no answers for him. Outside Robinson. Pass to Money. Stolen by Russell. From deep. And another three for Minnesota. Yeah, that's a great shot. Third three of the game for him first in this half. Here's Money, guarded by Russell. Left side, Robinson. Here's Money. Takes the three. Good. He hits again. Well, he's gone up to 40 as he continues to just dominate opponents all season long. And we knew he had a shot at it tonight. He is now tied for third for the most 40-point games in a season. And there's Russell on the assist by Reed. Russell's got five points now this quarter. It's not easy to work the ball inside in this league, but they've done it all night. And lead on the wing, guarded by Edwards. Here's Money. It's not going to go for him. Now Minnesota takes it the other way. Their next game playing at home as the Grizzlies come to town. And they'll be reaching the back half of a four-game home stretch. <laughs> Number 46. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Strengths and his limitation. And for Russell, he's still a volume scorer. But now I think he's better at picking his spots. And you can live with his percentages. I mean, he's improved his shot from the outside. It seems like he's always looking to refine his game. Beasley's checked in for the Timberwolves. No coverage that time. Siakam's got eight points. A sound decision maker. Siakam knew exactly how much time he had for the catch and shoot. To the middle. Here's Russell. And a nice finish on the layup. One side of a great playmaker. Hitting his man in stride. Here's Money, guarded by Russell. Money misses. The Timberwolves have gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter. Pass to Prince, and here's Russell. Now here's Reed. It's tipped. Outside for Russell. Just five to shoot. Picked by Prince from about 19. The shot by Russell, no good. Empty possession, and you don't want to miss these easy looks. Money misses. Minnesota's gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. Here's Miller. He's covered by Siakam. Here's Prince. And a foul call. On the Number 46. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. Oh, you know, actually nice. Back then, we'd see... Into the lineup for the Raptors. Timeout call for Minnesota. And that one misses. Releases. And no good. Trying to get that one to fall. And as we end the third. Your Minnesota Timberwolves. 77. The Raptors. 94.
It's been all Raptors. So for Toronto right now, they've got Goran Dragic. Mitchell Robinson is out there with OG Ananobi. And it's money in at the two. Yeah, showing a little versatility with their offensive attack. In the first half, it was about the three ball. In the second half, they've emphasized interior scoring. You know he's pulling his weight, but they still find themselves behind. Easily against Dragic. Pass to Money. Let's the three fly. Minnesota with a rebound. McDaniel's got four rebounds in the game. Beasley, the pass to Reed. Here's McDaniels. Out to Beasley. Second chance effort. And again, it's Minnesota converting. Spacing and ball movement. We hear coaches talk about those two elements all the time. Pass to Makai Luke. Timberwolves. Jaden McDaniels. That's his All right, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Raptors. What tremendous passing we've seen from them today. A very unselfish performance all around. The other thing, they continue to fill it up from three-point range, making it look easy. Gibson's checked in for Mikhailu. Now Edwards. Pass to Miller. There it is for him. What a burst out of that first step. Straight to the hole. Toronto shooting 52% from the floor so far. Dragic against Beasley. Money. Miller pulls it in. For Minnesota, they've gone three of four in the fourth and looking confident on offense. You don't want to stop the clock right there. I'm not quite sure what he was thinking. Russell's checked in for the Timberwolves. And Toronto also making a switch. Van Vliet's checked in for Dragic. For three, Prince with the bucket. When Prince gets it clicking from the perimeter, gets his confidence going, the entire offense benefits. And he makes it. He has 45 points. Dominating when it matters most. Give him the ball and get out of the way. Pass to Reed. A slam dunk by Reed. A strong finish to cut into that lead a little. And left no doubt with that one, Grant. Reed brings the double. And lead left side. Fires from deep. On target from range. Comfortable in catch and shoot situations. Fred does a lot of things for this team. Here's Russell. Here's Reed. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. Out to the right wing. Here's Prince. And another three from Minnesota. Vicious performance from him. Not the case for everyone else on his team. Reed brings the double. Here's Money, guarded by Russell. And it'll be on the wing. Jacks up a three. And the Raptors, another three. OG Ananobi matching three. Just a solid, steady player who continues to improve. Deflected. And he gets it back. Prince with the bucket. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Fourth quarter of play, and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. For Minnesota, they've gone 7 for 11 so far in the fourth. Now here's Edwards. Pass to Prince, to the inside. Reed, good. Reed's gotten four this quarter. Look at the unselfishness by Prince. Doesn't have what he wants. Keeps the ball moving. And stolen by Edwards. And here's Russell from behind the arc. The Timberwolves hit again from deep. Having a monster night from beyond the arc. He had two bombs in the first half. Now three more since. And it'll be on the wing. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. Call that time up the floor. The hard screen. Freeze him up for the bunny. The Raptors making a switch here. Siakam's checked in. Here's Miller. And 
the Timberwolves hit again from deep. And give them credit on the job they've done to narrow the gap with this big run. Into the lane. Money with the bucket. In this period, they're feeding him, and he's feeling it. Minnesota's gone 4-4 four four from outside during the fourth. Pass to Russell. Here's Prince. Now here's Russell. Launches a three. Toronto grabs the miss. Siakam's got his seventh rebound here tonight. And lead left side. Pass to Siakam. Here's Money, guarded by Russell. Here's Money. Three-pointer off the mark. Trying to shoot himself out of his slump. And it's not going well. Over to the wing. Here's Russell. And there are the Timberwolves with another bucket. Unselfish. Moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. Robinson passes to Siakam. Here's Money. Guarded by Russell. And yes! Another basket! And that gives him 51. Making it look easy. The Timberwolves trail. Outside Edwards. Back to Russell. Takes it inside. And then Russell with the dunk! Woo-wee! Big finish. Big time. And man, did they need that. You can tell he's trying to get him going with that dunk. You're totally right. That could be a shot in the arm for them. A spark that turned things around. Number 46. That's his fourth personal foul. Second team foul. And for Minnesota, they're shooting at 45% on the game so far. Pass to Miller. Here's Reed. Rebound by the Raptors. Siakam's got eight rebounds in the game. Money. It's blocked. Torian Prince saying, not on my watch. Spectacular D. Here's Miller. That shot's good. Russell making the play. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Reed brings the double. It's intercepted. Fast break, Minnesota. Tries the nine-footer. Edwards can't hit. And buckle up, guys. This play could decide the game. It's Robinson, high post. Inside. Money with the bucket. They have no answer defensively inside. Minnesota's gone four or five from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Russell into the lane. Count it. Russell's got nine points in the quarter. He has gotten into a terrific groove here, trying to wheel his team back into this. Outside Ananobi. Here's Money, guarded by Russell. Edwards against Van Vliet. Six to shoot. Out to the right wing. Here's Money. Oh, drew the foul. But he'll head to the line for three. Ooh, good defensive intensity. But you have to stay in control always. He hits the second from the line. And he makes all three. Drives to the hoop. And then Russell with the dunk. I'll tell you, those finishes are always extra special when they come from your point guard. Oh, forget about his passing. Can we see more dunking? It just shows you the versatility. This guy can do a lot of different things for you. Woo-wee! Siakam outside, down low. Money with the bucket. And the Raptors lead by seven. He is the story for them offensively and a big reason why they're ahead. Here's Russell. Sinks that one from the post. Russell's got 37. Hey, clashes with the larger defender and makes maybe the biggest shot of the game. You know, it's just a case where you just have to go up strong and live with the results. Nice job. Here's Miller. Tipped away. 
It's the fire he's playing with that has him leading the team in rebounds. Controlling the glass helps them maximize their number of possessions. He's done everything he can do to help them in that area. Toronto has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Yet another bucket. Oh, make that 61 points. Everything is going his way right now. Timeout called. The Timberwolves. For Minnesota. Fans, the loudest section gets free t-shirts. Let's see who's the loudest. All right, look who's coming on the court. Come on and get loud for your Minnesota Timberwolves dancer. Edwards finds Russell. Forty seconds left in the fourth. Rebound by the Raptors. They led the game at one point by 20. Money with the bucket. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. I think we can say that shot is well within his range. Yeah, let's hope so. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Money. Goes up on the baseline. That shot off. It's a three-on-three -three fast break. Miller can't get it to go. That's the end of the game. A big thank you to all of you fans who made it out tonight. Your support is what...